This sign gives an indication that a Kolobia community in Agwata local government area of a number state places a high premium on religion. But lately, there is some news making rounds that has the people here moving around in disbelief. And this can be traced to this compound. The residents of the Ezebe Kwes, the drama began with a revelation that came to this member of the family. At a point, one day I was like this, I was eliminated. I was eliminated. You know, I, I can't tell you how the thing started. Bone of my, he took me about three scriptures on bone of my bone. Leban said the same thing when Jacob came to him to marry. Uh, uh, and the same thing, the people of Judah told David when David became a king, you are the bone of our bone. You are. So he said that the, thing, the bone of my bone and flesh of my flesh is your blood, is your immediate family. Then one day he brought out the hand, hand of my sister in the spirit like this. He said that I am the one I'm talking about. It's not for me. Why? Both the color, the body, scissors, whatever, the fingernail and everything. He said, look at the one. Is this for? How did his brother take the message? I wanted to believe it, even though I will die on it or something like that. I wanted to believe it. Two revisions and everything like that. And uh, on 15th January, being in the evening, I was told to announce that marriage that day. I was just announcing it as we are standing here. Now, if this person is just a human being to be a witness to me, I just told them. If I didn't call them one after the other, they just came out. I want to tell the whole family today that we have believed to marry ourselves. That set the ball in motion for a marriage ceremony to take place. Now, this man, A23, is happily married to his 16-year-old sister. The bride appears to have taken it all in the good faith is what presented. Although the stigma has affected our parents at school. Because of what people have been saying about us, that's why I need to stop now, I talk now. But after we set to down, after everything is going down, then if I hear from God, we should continue and continue. When a parent is confronted with this kind of issue, whose side do they take? So, Auntie Emilia, our neighbors don't interact with us anymore because we are still trashing out the matter with the community. They say it's a taboo and an abomination. Until a cleansing is carried out, then the communion will start again and the community is preparing to carry out the cleansing rituals. But no matter the level of cleansing, it's only God that can neutralize any abomination, if any. The family may be fine with the matter, but the community has risen against it. At every turn is a rejection of the act. The color dwarf people or Tibia and so forth, or to drive them away out of the town, let's communicate. But this is a modern time. We need to watch the, the, the techniques and start. So we went to the priest and the priest accepted that the atrocity will be, <coughs> there will be a place of the atrocity. Biblically, it's ignorance that makes somebody put Bible about blood relationship. So that teaching is of the devil and that practice is of the devil. And let us watch that family for some years. You will see what will happen because science has even said that some of them will get mental. When should the line between right and wrong be crossed? Who determines what is justifiable or otherwise? The base over this will surely continue for a long time. But one thing that is certain is that this has placed Ecolobia on the map. Although many would have preferred if it were for a far less controversial reason.